Good afternoon. Thank you all for being here today. I'm Lieutenant Russell Park, Public Information Officer with the Lee County Sheriff's Office. We called this press conference today to announce an update in a recent homicide investigation. Uh, before we begin, I'd like to introduce a few of our agency members that are standing up here with us today. Uh, to my right is crime scene technician Laura Bellett. Laura played a major role in processing evidence at the crime scene. And then we also have our two case agents, detectives Christian Buchhofer and James Lathan. And now to give you more details about the investigation is Sheriff Carmine Marcino. Sheriff. Sure. Thank you. Thank you. Good afternoon. I'm Sheriff Carmine Marcino. Thank you for being here today. On the evening of June 28th, deputies responded to a shooting on Sunrise Boulevard in Lehigh Acres. When they arrived, deputies found two men who had been shot. Unfortunately, one of them died from his injuries. The incident was determined to be a homicide and our major crimes unit was notified. Shortly after, detectives arrived on scene and immediately got to work. They learned that this encounter began as a road rage and ended in a violent killing. Detectives received a description of the suspect and the vehicle from the surviving victim. The information was forwarded to Southwest Florida Crime Stoppers. In the last two weeks, detectives analyzed the evidence and collected at the scene. Together, our forensics division and major crimes detectives worked advanced investigative techniques to determine that the suspect drove a black Nissan Versa. Analysts from our real-time intelligence center used this information to track down the suspect. The shooter was then identified as 27-year-old Yusef Gooding. Detectives located Gooding in Jacksonville, Florida, where he was arrested on unrelated charges. Working closely with the state attorney's office, a warrant was written and signed for Gooding's arrest. Yesterday, our U.S. Marshals Regional Fugitive Task Force traveled to Jacksonville to bring Gooding back to Lee County to face his charges. Gooding is being charged with second-degree murder. My message has always been clear. Violence like this will never be tolerated in my county. The road rage Gooding displayed shows unstable and dangerous behavior that he displayed to this community. My team has proven you cannot hide. No matter where in the county or the state you flee to, we will hunt you down and put you in jail. Make no mistake, my team is number one and we are never gonna stop. This investigation is still ongoing, and I'll take a few questions. Which, sure, what's the charges you arrested yesterday? Uh, it's unrelated charges, but he's in Jacksonville, incarcerated, where we got him. Do you know if they were felony or misdemeanor? Unknown. Uh, at the beginning, there was said to be another woman in the car with him. Or do you have any update on her involvement with this? So obviously, it's an open act of investigation, and our detectives are still working this case fully. Uh, if anything unfolds, we will charge according if we get facts that, you know, that substantiate that. Is he from this area or is he Jacksonville? Our suspect is from Lehigh Acres. Was he around the neighborhood in that same neighborhood? So I believe he had a relation with someone or a, a contact in Lehigh. He's from Lehigh, but also uh, lived at a different place, so back and forth. Uh, obviously, the scene's open and active, but uh, I got to tell you, I want to stress this most importantly. Uh, I could not be more proud of the people that stand here. This would have been the case of who did it, uh, and using advanced investigative techniques, our real-time crime center, utilizing the latest, greatest technology like we have in this county for multiple different things. That's the reason our suspect is behind bars. I couldn't be more proud of them. Any other questions? Thank you for being here today.